All right, so here's a problem. I get my lighting working how I want to, and then I turn my computer off and back on, or I do a restart, and it's not working properly. Everything through MSI Mystic Light is supposed to be on color shift mode right now. And the keyboard, the mouse, the RAM, and the solid state drive are on color shift mode. But you notice here, the Leon Lee streamer, and the Alpha Cool CPU cooler, which are connected to headers on the motherboard, and the motherboard, are doing something else. I don't even know what mode. It's random what mode they'll turn on whenever I turn my computer on, or sometimes they'll just be completely off. And I think what it is, is, is Corsair IQ takes over those parts for some strange reason, and Corsair IQ causes this high CPU usage, usually between like 10 to 15 percent um, and it also makes my CPU run hotter usually between like 50 and 60 degrees Celsius and so if you go here hit control alt delete go to task manager I noticed there was this IQ service for MSI motherboard support and it, that's what's using all the CPU usage, and that's what's messing everything up. I can hit end task. It goes away. My CPU usage goes down. Temperature comes down to between like 35 and 40 degrees Celsius. And the only issue is when I go to restart my computer, well, that um, service will be running again. So I'm going to show you in a minute. There's a file that you can delete in Corsair IQ, to, so that way every time you start your computer, it doesn't come up, and everything will still work. IQ will still work, Mystic Light will still work, it's not going to mess anything up. It'll just make everything work better. But now, with that closed, I can actually come in here and fix the lights. So, I'm going to turn Mystic Light off, back on. And unsync everything resync everything so that's the motherboard lighting ssd ram corsair keyboard and mouse so we're still on color shift let's hit apply again it looks like everything did already fix itself but just to make sure yeah see now everything is in color shift mode like it's supposed to be except for the case that's a razor case if I wanted to, I could sync the Razer case with MSI stuff, but then my keyboard and mouse won't be synced, so. Um, what I usually do is just have my case on a similar pattern. So, it's almost synced, it's just, it's not representing the same color at the same time as everything else, but it's, it's doing a similar pattern. Um, so yeah, now let me show you where that file is you have to delete. To keep this working like this permanently so what you do go to your file explorer and you want to go to your local disk your c drive on your hard drive there or wherever your corsair files are and then usually your corsair file is going to be program files or program file x86 and then you go to corsair for me it's corsair iq4 i have the fourth one then you're going to go down to plugins. Then because it's an MSI motherboard, we're going to go to MSI. And here we go. This one right here. QMSIplugin.dll. What you want to do is delete it, which will send it to your recycling bin. And then if you want to permanently delete it, you can do it in recycling bin. Now see, I won't let you delete it because the program's open, right? So all we have to do is come down here. And go to Corsair IQ, right click, and hit quit. Now, my mouse is going to be a little hard to control. It's going to have to move really slowly. And CMSI is no longer controlling the lighting. But now we can uh, actually delete this file. And once that's gone, then I can open... Corsair IQ back up. See, now my mouse is working normally again. I 
control it a lot easier. And then um, you can see Corsair kind of took over the lighting, but that's okay. We could just, I could try to resync this again, or I could just restart my computer and everything will work as it should. <coughs> Restart anyways. See, now everything should be good after it restarts and then loads all the lighting programs back on the desktop. Okay, we're back. For, there we go, Razer just did its software and then Corsair and then MSI takes over, so. And now we have a color shift working on everything except for the the razor case is separate of course but you see that the, now the motherboard lights and the leon lee streamer and my alpha cool cpu cooler it's all synchronized now and now every time i restart my computer i don't have to touch anything my cpu usage is lower my uh my temperature stays between 35 and 40 instead of staying between like 50 and 60, so much better.